guys, so today I've got the Lego Harry Potter Wizarding World and it is a new set from 2021 and they're really clever because all of the Lego inside it folds up so it is portable and you can carry it around. So first up I'm going to show you the figures. These sets are 8 plus and I am going to probably show you this build in two videos. So let's get on. So we're going to start with the teachers. So we've got Herbology class and Transfiguration class. So Professor Professor McGonagall here, she has a nice really black detailed hat with just grey hair around the side if you can see that. With a lovely say with a lovely shade of jade with a bit of pattern on there, with a long flowing skirt. But this means that she can't sit down because she's got like a square bit on the bottom. And I think this is a, her like her cloak, the, um, the jade inside the black skirt with the necklace. And she has a lovely black wand and she has two faces. She has a really cross and miserable face and then happy smiley face. But I think we'll keep her on happy smiley face. We don't want to cross Miss McGonagall, Professor McGonagall. Anyway, let's move on to the herbology teacher. Yes. So here she is called Professor Sprout. And she has this really detailed hat. And it's really clever how they managed to get these creases all around it to show she's wearing it. And they have got grey curly hair around the side of it. And if you can see there, they are earmuffs. All of the people in the set come with them because they are dealing with, in herbology class, they're all learning about this screaming mandarin plant and they're really loud, so you have to protect your ears. She has got this really nice pattern and it's got three berries with these green leaves. So I think it's like mistletoe or holly or something like that. <laughs> And then there's a muff coming down and she's got the legs which bend so they've got holes in which enable her to bend and two of the people in this set come with it but the third one does not sadly she has brown fruits in this on her so that and so this is her face here she can be really smiley and then she has this smile but it's not as nice. I don't know if you'd agree with me but I prefer this happy smiley face. I know it's more happy. So that's her. Okay now we're going to move on to the students learning. So I think that I should start with Hermione oh, yeah. Granger. She comes in this set with a beige wand and I just simply love this hair piece. If I can guess, oh, she she has two pieces of hair down the front, a fringe with a piece in the middle, with like a gap in the middle, then all the way down and wavy. I don't think she looks like Hermione there. Um, add in the comments if you think she does, but she with her hair she really does look like Hermione Granger. And the other student also had this same jumper, the same Hogwarts jumper. I think this set is for the. Gryffindors because it's got the red and the yellow and later on you'll see another surprise but these legs you can't bend them and they're black and also the other student has them with the holes so it means that they can sit down and Hermione Granger has two faces a stressed out face about the spells or a casual cheeky face I prefer the casual cheeky face Let's see what your students look like. Okay, so we have got Neville Longbottom and if you are a fan of Harry Potter or read the book, you would know who he is. He has got two faces as well. All the sets come with it. So he has got the legs which do not bend. They do not have holes in, so he cannot sit down, I'm afraid, which is a shame but there's not much sitting down when you've got to do gardening is there so he's one of his faces it's quite sad he's 
probably stressed out about gardening or something. And then here he's got this kind of, he does look a bit worried, but I don't know if that's his casual face. Maybe you can tell me in the comments. So, and then he has this wand, which is, I think says his brothers, because if you've read the books, he does have brothers. So he's got a black wand, and you can choose lots of different colours of wands for him, but he specifically has a black one. His printing on his t-shirt is really unique to this set because I haven't seen it anywhere else and it goes around the back too. It's really clever actually because it shows that he's wearing it. Okay, so that is Neville Longbottom for you. Oh my gosh, he's just taken a tumble. Sorry, I'll have to get him. What are you doing, Cedric Diggory? No. Sorry about him. It's causing a bit of trouble. Anyway, so next we have got someone from the Transfiguration. And that is Ron Weasley. He also comes with his rat, which is a bit disgusting. But, yeah, it's really cool. Because, yeah, like it's, I think it's a beigey colour. If Anyway, enough about the rat, and let's look at Ron Weasley. So he has like this orange flicked hair, which is like around the side. So if, if I just show you that, if you might be able to see it, then I really like the flicked bits around the side. Anyway, let's look at his face. So on, I've put him on like a casual, I know how to do it face. But on the other side, he's terrified and does not know how to do it. But I prefer him with I know how to do it face. And he has the same top as Hermione, the one with the Gryffindor jumper, the red and yellow and the Gryffindor tie, I think, with the brown wand, which is specifically for him, and the same bottoms as Hermione because they have holes in the bottom and they're black and you can't move them. So they can't sit down. That's very sad because the set does come with chairs. So I just they just have to stand on the chairs. Professor McGonagall has fallen down. I think I better pick her up. Someone might be in for some extra work lessons. Okay, so the last person who comes in these two sets is Cedric Diggory, who was the one causing trouble earlier. I'm not quite sure if he's a troublemaker. I'm not a big fan of Harry Potter. I love their books, so I've read the first one. Anyway, so here he is. He's wearing the same top as Neville Longbottom was wearing, but he's got the two holes in his bottoms which enable him to sit down. So he can bend his leg like this, which is good because you can do a lot more with them. He has a wand as well, and he also has the earmuffs. So like all of the other people in the set, he has two faces. So here is the first one, he's kind of smiling, nothing. And then here he is quite angry, I think, or stressed about probably something which isn't working. And then here, this is a really nice piece of hair. It's brown, and yeah, it just fits on really easily like this there we go so he looks quite confident so there we go that is the last of the figures in the set now let's get on to the building so if i just take off the figures of the transfiguration book let's just stand them up here for a second so you can see that there is this base plate on top so you don't lose any of the figures and they can just stand on there and it is the same for the transfiguration class so this is the front of the book as this is the herbology class it has lots of plants on so here's a mushroom and this is a squirming mandarin i was telling you about it has a big hogwarts sign and Yes, so you build the spine like this, 
we build every 